awarded number one rabbi in America. His sermons are beautiful life lessons. He's written numerous books. He's a scholar. Many of you may have recently seen him on Face the Nation, that Sunday morning program. He's a friend to us all. Please welcome Rabbi Wolf. I want to begin by telling you that my friend who I'm sitting next to tonight, Herschel Nagy, leaned over and reminded me that not so long ago, I said that the man who contributed the most to Sinai Temple and in fact to the Los Angeles Jewish community should be thanked. So I want to thank the Ayatollah Khomeini. <laughs> Clearly, there is nobody in this yeshiva who deserves my daughter's hand. 
He got back into his carriage and he started to ride away and he saw one of the last three students running after the carriage, yelling for him to stop. So he stopped. And the student looked in the window and he said, I don't know the answer. But before you go, I need to know what the answer is. And the man said, you're the man I want for my daughter. It is the desire to know, the drive to learn, the need to achieve. That is what has always characterized the best of our people. It doesn't mean they've always had the chance to do it. Sometimes the world conspired to try to take it away from them. But you can make it possible. You can be the one who gives the scholarship to that student who will look in the window and say, I need to know the answer. There is no more beautiful, more noble, more Jewish thing to do. So thank you.